We at the Wildlife Trust are really excited to have brought the street artist ATM down to Portsmouth to paint a mural of a cuttlefish here at the Portsmouth Museum. He normally paints bird species but this is his first marine portrait um, and he's chosen a cuttlefish species as it is locally found in the Solent but also all around the UK uh, and they're quite incredible and most people won't have ever seen one uh, but they can change the colour of their skin and the texture as well depending on the circumstance and whether they're camouflaging themselves to either from predators or to catch other prey. Um, so it's really exciting to have this brought to our city streets. The Wildlife Trust got in contact with me because they wanted uh, me to paint something for National Marine Week and then they chose Portsmouth as the kind of location for the painting and then it was about the species that live in the Solent and so I chose um, a cuttlefish in the end simply because I, was, I just found it the most intriguing somehow and the most uh, personable really. Uh, there's something very appealing about them. When ATM came over to do this project, we wanted to show him a little bit about the area that the cuttlefish are visiting. They come here once a year to breed in spring and summer. And they rely on, upon a particular habitat, the seagrass meadows, these fantastic underwater grassy meadows. Going to ride was a, a real um, eye-opener for me with you know, amazing colonies of animals and I was looking at things under a little handheld kind of microscope, a little magnifier and, and yeah, all the different kinds of barnacles, all the different species. I, I did use quite a lot of colour and I wanted to show something of the kind of iridescence and luminosity of them so um, who knows how, exactly how uh, true to nature it is but I wanted to be kind of jump off the wall of it. But it made, it made me realise what an, an amazing habitat um, the seagrass is where the cuttlefish lay their eggs. Yeah, it's a real, a real haven for uh, lots of different species all living together. So it's well worth protecting.